Hello friends, in case you've been experiencing this error, you have been kicked due to unexpected client behavior in your old box, then in this video I'm going to show you three steps that you're going to take in order for you to be able to solve this. So the first one is for you to run a command prompt. So you're going to type cmd, cmd, and then you right click and select run as administrator. Run as administrator. So after that, you're going to enter these two commands. I'm going to be showing them on the screen so that you can easily copy them. So you're going to enter these two commands in their order. So the first one is this one. So I'm going to be typing letter by letter so that you can be able to follow through. So the first one is IP config forward slash flash DNS and then you click enter. So after that one, you're going to enter the second one and it's also going to be popped in the screen here. And then you click enter. Oh, I didn't. I was not supposed to put one letter. So it's supposed to be this one. net sh leave space windsock windsock not windstock so it's windsock reset and then you click enter so after entering those two commands you are going to restart your pc so you're going to restart your pc and then now we can be able to move to the next two steps so if at all after restarting you find this is working then it's okay you do not need to perform the other next step that i'm going to show so having restarted your PC, uh, if if the thing if it still persists, then you're going to do this next setting. So you're going to go to your settings. So you go to all settings. Then under that you select network and internet. Network and internet. So from there you come to advanced network settings so under that you will see the option of change adapter options and network and sharing center so you select change adapter options so after that you come to ethernet but apparently mine is not connected to any network but that is the procedure you're going to follow you're, you're going to come to ethernet and then you select properties you right click your mouse and select properties So after that, uh, you will see a list of, op of options, but you're going to scroll down and you select this one, the one that I'm highlighting, Internet Protocol version 4, and then you click Properties. So from there still, you will be given two options, but on the first one, where I'm highlighting, you're not going to put anything, but then on the second one, you're going to put the digits the way you see them on the screen here. So you're going to enter where there is preferred DNS server, you enter 111 and then where there is alternate DNS server, you put 1001 and then you click OK and then you basically, yeah, and then you, you close. So you click OK and then you close. So here you do not need to restart your PC but basically in case you'd like to, you can restart and uh, you'll be able to open your roll box. So now the last one is to make sure that you've cleared all the temporary files in your PC. So in order to achieve that, you're going to go and search for percentage temp percentage. So you search percentage temp percentage. So this is going to bring a list of the temporary files that you have in your PC. And then you make sure that you delete all the temporary files. So when you open, you can highlight them by pressing Ctrl A and you can delete by pressing Shift and Delete key at the same time. So when you have done that, you restart your PC and I hope by doing this you will be able to run your rollbox successfully. 
so let me hope this video helps you in case it does please don't forget to give a thumbs up comment and also in case you have not subscribed please don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss my future videos and i hope to see you in my coming video